meiosis cell division in an animal cell meiosis meiosis produces a total of four haploid cells from each original diploid cells it is required to run the reproductive cycle of eukaryotes meiosis or reduction division is so named as it results in the formation of four daughter cells each with half the number of chromosomes meiosis occurs in two stages meiosis 1 reduction division and meiosis 2 equational division meiosis 1 meiosis 1 is divided into four stages prophase 1 this is the most important phase of meiosis the sub stages of prophase 1 are leptotene the homologous pairs of chromosomes start becoming apparent by systematic coiling of the chromatin network chromosomes in this stage appear like a bouquet zygotene the shortening and the thickening continues and the chromosomes become distinctly apparent the pairing of homologous chromosomes begins the pairing is called synapsis pachytene at pachytene stage each homologous pair of chromosomes has four chromatids diplotene in this stage the paired chromatids are usually held together at one or more points these points of contact are called chiasmata at these points exchange of chromosomal material takes place this is also called crossing over diakinesis the bivalents become condensed to the maximum and are evenly distributed throughout the nucleus the nuclear membrane starts disappearing metaphase 1 the bivalents get arranged in the equatorial plane spindle formation starts while nuclear membrane and nucleolus disappear completely anaphase 1 each homologous chromosome starts moving towards the opposite pole of the cell actual reduction of chromosome occurs at this stage the chromosome which is moving towards the pole is either of maternal or paternal origin telophase 1 the nuclear membrane is reorganized and nucleolus reappears the chromosomes start uncoiling thus two haploid daughter nuclei are formed meiosis 2 prophase 2 both the daughter cells go through a short resting phase or interphase before meiosis 2 it is directly followed by metaphase 2 metaphase 2 new spindles are formed and the chromosomes still made up of pairs of chromatids line up on the metaphase plate anaphase 2 the centromeres now divide and the chromatids move to the opposite ends of the cell telophase 2 nuclear envelopes reform and the chromosomes return to their interphase state cytokinesis occurs giving four daughter cells each with half chromosomal number of the original diploid cell 